Hey viewers, and welcome to part 12 of my Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green. Last time we got Bill out of being a Clefairy and he gave us the SS ticket to go on the SS Annie cruise ship to Vermilion City. Like I promised, we are going to go to Vermilion City. We're gonna go there, like right now. We're now gonna, we're now gonna move on and gonna go through here. Team Rocket broke in, so you'll have to go up against. Um, he says, "Hey, stay out! It's not your yard, huh? Me? I'm an innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? Uh, no, you idiot." You are a rocket grunt. You work for a criminal organization. No, literally, viewers. He works for a criminal organization. Level 22, nice. I think like four more levels and Pikachu will learn Thunderbolt. Which is actually, whoops, which is actually pretty good. First we're gonna paralyze Drowsy, then we're gonna use Slam. Hypnosis, terrific. That's just plain terrific. I don't like I don't like doing trainer battles much, viewers. It's just not my type of thing. Thank you. Okay, so that grunt is finished. I think he gives us TM28, which is dig. So that person left. We're now going to go to Vermilion City. Like, officially. We're now going to go to Vermilion City. Down here in the, in the grass, you can find Meow. Pidgey and Sparrow and some other Pokemon. Now we're going to go to the underground path, which does not take long to do. Now there are trainers along this route, so I'm going to skip them. That was a brutal battle. Pikachu is at 1 HP now, so we'll, we'll have to officially switch. I have no potions with me, so we'll have to heal Pikachu once we get to, um, once we get to Vermilion. Now this bug trainer right here, he will have a, he will have a, a Butterfree level 20, so just watch out. I defeated that Butterfree with, with my Pikachu at 1 HP, I took one Thundershock, critical hit, paralyzed Butterfree, then Butterfree couldn't move because it was paralyzed, and I just used one more Thundershock, Butterfree fainted. Level up Pikachu. Okay, switch.
Okay, now we're finally in Vermilion City after all those battles. I'll show you something else that will help you in the process. Um, you know that lady that's standing right beside me while I'm healing my Pokemon? Talk to her, she'll give you the Verse Seeker. So you'll get that, and then you could battle people over and over again to train. Which would come really handy in the process. Okay, now we are going to go get a Diglett. But I'm not sure we're going to do that just yet. Um, this is going to be our third gym. Your gym leader will be Lieutenant Surge, who likes electric type. We're officially going to go to... We're going to catch a Diglett in our next part. So, so we're going to go on the St. Annie, the SS Annie, and we're going to go train. There are a lot of Pokemon trainers on this cruise ship. I would start from bottom to top, because that's what I've been doing before. Oh, and if you think somebody threw up in here, it's really a Hyper Potion. Okay, let's go in here. You can find items in everybody else's room. Okay, so you'll find sailors around here. I recommend electric and grass, so I'm gonna battle them off screen. And another, if you see a fisherman like this guy, um, just use electric. I'm gonna switch. I promised you viewers that in part 11 that we would go to Vermilion and we are in Vermilion. Time to search the next um, cabin. These are what are called cabins on cruise ships. If you guys never been on a cruise before, that's what they're called. We're gonna battle him off camera also. Okay, what's this item? Okay, TM44 rest. Make sure you get all the items before you heal the before you heal the captain. Or else you'll just lose a lot of items. Then you then the cruise ship will never come back. Honest to God. Okay, so right when you come in that door, you'll go up against the trainer and here you'll find an ether that'll come in handy later on in the game. What do you find in this cabin? Sometimes cabins just have nothing. Okay, so this so this is a trainer. I pressed a button. Guess he's another trainer. Okay, so those are two sailors. They all have water type. Just use a Pikachu or an Ivysaur. We're going to go into this cabin now. Oh, here's an item. A super potion. Not bad. Let's talk to this guy. My buddy Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to move big rocks. Strength is an HM. Strength is an HM, and that's HM4, strength. We're going to head up these stairs now, and we're going to go into these cabins. The main floor cabins. This guy would have, like, a Growlithe or a Vulpix. If you have a Vulpix, that'll be Leaf Green. If, you ha if, if you're going to go find a Vulpix, you'll have to have Pokemon Leaf Green. If you're looking for a Growlithe, you'll be playing Fire Red. Let's see, is there any items? No, there is not. Nope. Okay, at least talk to this woman. You look tired. Would you like to have a short rest? Yes! Okay, so if you go into this cabin, your Pokemon will be healed. Like as if it's a small Pokemon Center. Okay, let's go in here. Okay, next.
Waiter, I would like a cherry pie, please. What the? Uh, give me a break. Is this girl even battle? Nope. A world cruise is so elegant yet cozy. I always travel with Wigglytuff. I never leave home without it. You're calling it... Out it? You're calling a creature an it. That's mean. Well, we battle those trainers off camera. Well, viewers, next time on Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green, we're going to go up against more trainers on this cruise ship and eventually beat Gary. See you in our next part of Part 13. Bye.